This video we are going to talk about whitetail eye finishing with pan pastels. Here's our dry eye. We're going to mix a two part epoxy and we're going to just work it in in between the skin and the glass eye. Now we'll just take a brush and clean off the epoxy off the glass eye. At this point we will put a liquid latex over the glass eye to protect it from paint. That way when we're done we can just peel this right off. I will then let the latex dry a little bit and then we will begin to put a little bit of the bumps that are underneath the eye. I'm just trying to be very careful to make sure that they sit on top of that eye skin here. We'll go the whole way around the eye and around the top of the eye. We'll be using pan pastels. We'll be using a black. We we'll use a permanent red shade. We use that more in the early season deer. We use a magenta tint for the fleshy undertones. Then we'll use several shades of brown, the burnt sienna, the burnt sienna shade, and the burnt sienna extra dark. We also use a raw umber extra dark and a burnt sienna tint. And those are the colors that we like to use for the pan pastels to finish an eye. We are now ready to paint this eye. The first color I will put on here is a red. And this color I will lay under the fleshy color that I'll put on next. It just helps build the tones. You can see the red color looks a little harsh, but we will take a flesh color over it and it'll just blend that right in. And now we'll begin to put the brown shades in. The burnt sienna, the burnt sienna shade, and the burnt sienna extra dark. We will now put the burn umbrer extra dark over the nodules that we made earlier. Now we will take a piece of felt and rub the paint out of the hair around the eye and clean it up a bit. Now I will take the burnt sienna tint and the burnt sienna shade and just build a couple extra layers on here just to give it some more depth.
Once we get the eye color close to where we would like it, we will then stick a gloss in between the glass eye and the skin. And now we can peel the latex that we put on to protect the eye earlier. And here is now our finished eye. That's all for this chapter. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit the subscribe button. Thank you.